In this video, I will share how to create SEO friendly URL structures that are loved by Google. The URL structures may seem less important than other elements, but it can be a powerful tool for achieving SEO success. Let's learn the SEO best practices for URLs. The first tip is to standardize your URLs in lowercase. Most web servers treat lower and uppercase URLs the same, but this isn't always the case. To be on the safe side and to avoid potential duplicate content issues, always use lowercase URLs. The second tip is use hyphen instead of underscore in the URL. This is one of the recommendations of keep a simple URL structure from the official Google Search Central documentations. Besides, underscore are invisible when formatted in the link. This means that user might be unable to accurately see what the URL. The third tip is avoid dates in your URL. If you're using WordPress, by default it sets to the date and month from a link structure, which is not the best practice. Switching to the post name option is the better configuration. Furthermore, this practice will future proof your URLs. For example, you can see many review sites just update the content of the page from time to time when new products emerge. If you include the dates in your URLs, indirectly you create the expired date for the page. The fourth tip is to remove the numbers in your URLs. This is useful for future modification to the page so the URL still looks logical and relevant. Hence, the page can become the evergreen content that can serve you for a very long term. It also makes the URLs neat and tidy. The fifth tip is to including the primary keywords. Most titles naturally contain keywords, which are also create a better user experience for users. You are free to insert words that are not in the main title or completely simplify the URLs just to remain the keywords that are important. Most of the time, I will remove the stop words that are fine to ignore in the URLs. This is to avoid overly long characters. The sixth tip is to avoid URL parameters where possible. URL parameters usually appear after a question mark in the URL. These are common on e-commerce sites where different colors or other sorting options will have a new parameter. Eventually, this makes the URLs non-readable and potential for duplicate content issues. Usually, applying the canonical link will solve this issue. The seventh tip is using subfolder to provide hierarchies. Subfolders help provide a sense of hierarchy and give useful extra information. Using subfolders also make it easier to incorporate keywords into URLs without them looking spammy. This format is essential for any online store to have a clear navigation expectation for users. Okay, that's all for the tips to create SEO-friendly URL structures. I recommend reading this SEO starter guide and advanced SEO documentation from Google Search Central. Check the links at the description. Thanks for watching and remember to share this video. See you in the next video. <laughs>